Okay, I had a chance to complete the uh, design of your copy room with the changes requested. And I'll go over those with you in this video, just so we're all, all on the same page. These base cabinets, let me highlight my mouse. These base, this one here, and this one, and this one, behind the two doors will have a full depth shelf. This base cabinet is a single pull out trash, and these are all working drawers on the top of the base cabinets. Wall cabinets will have adjustable shelves. This is 15 inches deep. Fifteen inches. Fifteen inches deep. These cabinets over on this wall here are going to be 18 inches deep. You can see a cubby hole area. And then a second cubby hole area over here. Those cubby holes are going to be made on site. I'm going to give you the material to make those cubby holes, but they will have to be made on site, which is pretty easy to do. Um, I can chat with Wayne about doing that. It's pretty easy to do. Um, then we have a blind corner cabinet here. There's a working drawer here and a door. We'll put a full depth shelf in here as well. This box right here represents your shredder. This, which is kind of hard to tell, but this circular item, actually go like this. This circular item represents the trash that you have in the, in the copy room today. And then this rectangular rep represents the PC, uh, then there was another thing that looked like a, um, either a battery backup of some sort, um, and then there's another one. So you have room to put <coughs> the computer underneath this desk drawer, which will be held up with two three-quarter inch panels. And then there will be 18 inches of space from the top of the counter to the bottom of the wall cabinet. So hopefully your monitor will fit there. You can see the, uh, a dummy monitor, monitor that I have here. And we're going to go to the ceiling with the cabinets, except for I'm going to add some fascia molding and then some scribe to the top of the cabinets. They won't, cabinets won't go, you, won't, you wouldn't want to jam your cabinets all the way to the ceiling but there'll be like an inch and a half of what they what, what I would call fascia and then scribe going to the ceiling. Then you can see how we've changed the height of the cabinets to accommodate the copier machines which are here and here. And just to clarify, this is again 15 deep storage from here over. And then this is going to be 18 inch deep storage. And then this is going to go back to 15 inch deep storage. The base cabinets are a standard 24 deep. Let me know if I can clarify anything. Next I shall work on a formal estimate. I know I gave you a pretty good idea of the cost. Next I will work on the formal estimate.